my channel is dying and this is not clickbait this is literally happening as we speak right now I'll show you some of my analytics and I'll explain to you in a second and I really 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 need your help without your help I'm not sure if this channel will make it or if there will be a future for this channel so before we get into the sort of nitty gritty of it uh, I want to make some free, some important announcements so my free consultations are now closed so you can't book a free consultation call with me and uh, you know when I told you a few months ago that it would be temporary I wasn't kidding it wasn't like some marketing gimmick consultations are closed now so if you want to talk to me in the future I don't think it'll be free but uh, I'll, I'll let you know about that in the future the reason why I want to stop the free consultation is that I want to turn the coaching that I was doing helping people who are feeling lost in their early 20s I want to turn that from a coaching program to an online course that you can go through at your own pace so you don't need to speak to me face to face to get the same results and maybe you even get better results. The course will be at a much, much lower price. Why? Because I want it to make it accessible to the entire world. You know, if it's at an affordable price, I feel like I'll be able to help more people. Stay tuned for that because I'll be making more announcements about the course. So now let's get into the topic of the video. What's been happening is that the last few months, you know, starting at the beginning of this year in 2022, I was making roughly maybe 150 to 200 subscribers per month. And now we're down to about 40 to sometimes even 38, 35 subscribers per month. So that's literally an 80% decrease from usual. Uh, it seems like my old videos are no longer performing and uh, you know my new vi my newer videos also are letting are getting much less views than before and I'm also have very few comments per video I have a lot less comments so what will be the causes of my channel dying I'm not exactly sure which is why I'm shooting this video to sort of get feedback from you guys and maybe it's because my videos you don't like my videos as much or maybe you grew out of my videos uh, I'm gonna tell you maybe some internal factors I think that could be leading to that thing is because I've been lacking motivation uh, the last few months in terms of maintaining this this channel uh, and the reason why is because in a strange way you know I started this channel with this sort of idea of self doing self-help and I've kind of lost interest in self-help why because I feel like self-help is you know is sort of you know especially sort of in the bookstore section and the overall industry how it is it, it's kind of repetitive and the information is is sort of repeated ad nauseum on how to build more confidence, overcome fear, and, and all of that. Because of that, probably the passion, maybe the loss of passion is being felt in my videos. Maybe you felt that maybe, you know, I was sort of lacking the motivation or lacking the interest, lacking the enthusiasm. Maybe you could feel in my videos. And maybe that, that impacted my views, impacted my channel in some way. I'm not exactly sure, so let me know in the comments. Um, and I think one big factor why maybe my channel is dying is because there's sort of a disconnect between myself and what the market wants. So I noticed in the self-help market on YouTube and all that, it seemed like people, they want like the very basic stuff. So for example, how to get a girl, how to deal with your parents, how to stop caring about what other people think, how to be successful, how to start out at all, a social media page and blow up, become famous. It's sort of these materialistic needs that people are looking for. And me, those are not things that relate to me. So for example, I've had some people ask me how to be more masculine, questions like how do I deal with this toxic person? These sort of basic questions now, because they no longer interest me, I no longer want to make videos on those things. Now the things that I'm passionate about are a little more advanced. So for example, developmental psychology. I've got a big interest recently in sort of ego development, how that works, even transpersonal psychology. Now I'm looking into philosophy like Albert Camus and all that. And so my, my interests have changed. And the problem with that is that if you make a video about, I don't know, the meaning of life and all that, it's gonna get less views than, let's say, how to fuck 10 bitches, uh, you know, <laughs> this month, or what's, you know, some stupid title like this. And it's unfortunate in the self help niche, and you see, I see a lot of uh, YouTube uh, videos, um, titles like, watch this video every morning, you feel better, or like, this graph is the secret to, secret to how I improve my life. You know, this sort of, these sort of clickbaity titles and the problem with that is I feel like it devalues the actual 
content of the video because you're not actually providing you know much information with the title you're just sort of incentivizing people to click and yes this is good in a sense that those people that do that they they succeed they get more views and all that and maybe they have great content to offer so the sort of the title works in that sense but i find it's it just it sucks that this is what works you know what works is you know the clickbait titles and you have to play the clickbait game or else you won't get any views and i've tried playing that game and all that and i do get more views when i use sort of more clickbaity titles i think that's one big issue is that i don't really care about the marketing i, I want to make sure that my videos are the best that i can i'd rather spend 90 percent of the time work on working on the video making it the best possible and only one percent on the title or in thumbnail so that I put all of my energy in the video but the problem also when I do that is that I get less views so it's strange it's like I need to one stay true to myself and what I enjoy so that my content you know keeps fresh and I enjoy doing it but at the same time if I only follow what I want to do and I don't listen to the market or I don't listen to you guys then I'm gonna make videos that are not gonna connect and I'm gonna get less views which leads me to, I think, other causes why my channel will be dying, which is which are external causes. So, for example, maybe my audience is growing out of my channel. And I, I saw a video about a guy who, you know, has a self-improvement channel, and he pointed out this problem in the self-help industry, is that most people, when they consume self-help, at some point, they no longer need your help. Why? Because they were helped. They took your advice, and in a sense, if you subscribe to my channel, you watch my videos, and you no longer need my videos because you've learned everything you had to learn, then in, a, then in a strange way, you no longer watching my videos is a good thing. Because it means that my advice is working. So it's like, well, th that's messed up. It's like, the better I get, the more people are gonna, are, are gonna leave it. It's kind of how it works. And I remember one of my coaching clients, we worked for a while and, um, you know, only after three to four calls, she was totally good to go. And, and I reached out to her like six months later, asking her if she needed more help. She said no. So in a strange way, I'm making less money by helping people more. How, how crazy is that, right? How crazy is that? But that's kind of how the self-help niche works. And also other external causes like the YouTube algorithm is constantly shifting. So that's very hard to keep up with. And uh, yes, yeah, and honestly, it's, it's like it's it's sad to see that some some of my some of my best videos, the best performing videos that I had, now are getting half the views or even less. So now the videos that were getting me subscribers now are dying, and now my new videos aren't able to catch up and you know compensate for the lack of views from my older videos. If that makes sense. Yeah, so this is hard for me to ask, but I need your feedback. I need to, I need to be very truthful and you know be transparent with you guys, and you need, you guys need to also be transparent with me. And I need you to tell me all this brutal feedback to me, and I'll make sure to read every single comment because it's quite urgent. And if my videos just keep getting low views like that, and it's just gonna die it's gonna die in nothingness and like every other channel is gonna just pile up on top of mine and my videos will never be discovered right so are you still watching my channel are you still watching my videos or you know maybe you clicked on this video because you saw the title but you were not actually watching my videos um because you know if i have 30k uh, 30k subscribers obviously most of you are not watching my videos so are you still watching my channel? If so, what videos do you enjoy most? What sort of topics do you like to to uh, uh, learn about in my on my channel? And which videos do you skip over? Which videos you don't watch? Which which videos you don't want to watch? And why is that? Why why are there some videos that you just don't want to watch? Uh, is it because uh, they're too long, or maybe they're too repetitive, or you know, to give me all the details and. You know, if you no longer watch my channel as much, have you maybe grown out, grown tired of my channel? And if so, why is that? And what, idea, what ideas do you have for me you know, to improve? Or what kind of future videos you'd like to see? What kind of topics? And you know, if you have any suggestions about the overall direction of my channel, of course, this is mostly up to me, but I'm just curious to know what kind of suggestions you have as to where I could take Nameless. 
Um, and you know, I understand that I may never be able to perfectly bridge the divide between you and me in a sense that maybe you want something out of my videos and me, I want something else. You know, I have different desires. So for example, my desires and passions now are headed towards psych, but maybe your desires are more about, you know, getting girls and then of course that's what you want but because that's not what I want then of course there's always going to be this weird disconnect but I still want to hear your perspective and even if I can 1% improve how we connect together as an audience you and I then that'd be better so in conclusion what are my ideas and where do I want to what do I want to do with my channel moving forward well I want to go, as I said, in more sort of the philosophy, psychology, developmental psychology, transpersonal psychology, spirituality area, so which is more a bit more advanced, sort of similar to actualize.org, and dive into deeper topics. Also have some videos that are maybe more ranty, more vloggy, sort of stream of consciousness, where I don't necessarily script the video. Uh, but I'll sort of explain to you, you know, sort of my experiences. Um, I know I did videos like talking about my burnout experiences, how I recovered, and some people seem to really like that. And there seemed to be decent engagement on these videos, especially when I talk about myself. I think some of you guys like it. Do you like the vlog videos? You like me just talking like this, no music, just me talking like that. I'd like to hear your opinion on that. And I'm also starting a new channel that's going to be a variety gaming channel. Now on this channel I'm going to be live streaming various games from uh, first person shooter games like um, uh, PUBG, Escape from Tarkov, or uh, even Overwatch, and even different games like RuneScape. And I'm also going to be answering some of your questions. I'm going to be doing that and what I like about this format is that it's going to be a lot more laid back. So you ask me questions and I'm just sort of playing games at the same time. So we kind of have like a kind of have this conversation together that's just more casual than me sort of serious talking to camera with with music on you know like like my videos uh, on this channel um, and there's going to be some occasionally occasional uh, gaming videos about whatever thing that i feel like doing so this is me really branching out completely branching out but also still sort of staying true to my roots when it comes to self-improvement and psychology and all that so let me know your thoughts below and I want to hear all of your feedback uh, so I can improve this channel, make it better so you guys want to see the videos that you want to see. And again, tell me all your ideas. Tell me what kind of videos you want to see, uh, what, what's your, what are your suggestions as to the overall direction of my channel and tell me, you know, if you got tired of my channel, tell me why. If there are some videos you don't watch, tell me why. Tell me why. And what are the videos that you do watch and do you do and that you do watch until the end and that you are interested in so that I can make more of those videos. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Peace.